great to see everybody out here. Thank you, Chris Stewart, for the introduction. Um, thank you, Dr. Bell, for presenting and na this naming and to the Board of Trustees who give us just wonderful support for approving this well-deserved honor for the Sabins. It goes without saying that we have a tremendous amount of football history here, as well as significant history in many of our other programs. When Regina and I first arrived in Tuscaloosa, one of the first conversations that Coach Saban and I had, you may be surprised by this, he challenged me. He said, many of our programs have done really well. However, are we taking advantage of the historical success on the football field as well as we can for the rest of the athletic department? Meaning, are we taking advantage of the success, the visibility, the expectation for excellence, et cetera, across the department to positively impact all of our teams and student athletes? What a great challenge. Through his actions, meeting with recruits for all sports, meeting with other teams, attending games, he did everything he could to help us achieve success across the board. No doubt, he and Miss Terry cared about football, but they also cared about the entire department and the university. I remember one time Coach Saban, Miss Terry, Regina, and I were in Florida together in the spring for an event. We actually had an entire hour free, and we ended up watching Alabama softball together in that free hour. They knew exactly where the team was, how the season was going, and much of the roster on the team as well. That wasn't unique to softball. It's efforts like these from Coach Saban and Miss Terry that benefited our entire department, not just those in football, but across the board. I'll also tell you from my firsthand experience just how much Coach Saban cares about the game of football. I served on the NCAA Football Oversight Committee for four years when the committee would have different issues that we were discussing and debating about the structure of college football, I would often go to coach to discuss. His thoughtfulness and transparency made you understand that he wanted what was best for the game of college football, not just Alabama. He made so many people better, including myself. Coach Saban and Miss Terry made Regina and me see just how important it is to look beyond the job and truly have an impact on our community. We are forever grateful for all they've done and will continue to do in Tuscaloosa and beyond. Today is a celebration of you, Coach Saban and Miss Terry, and we're thrilled to honor you. At this time, please join me in welcoming to the podium, Nick and Terry Saban.